So I heard you want to get rich in Driving Empire, but you are currently poor. Well, today, I'm going to show you the best ways to get rich. But the first step is to make sure you're subscribed and drop a like on this video. Also, follow all these socials that will pop up here throughout the video. But without further ado, let's get right into it. Alright, so before I go ahead and start showing you the ways to make money, there's actually two things I need to go over that you cannot do to make money in this game. You will get banned if you do either of these. So the first one, it's using hacks to AFK grind. It basically just makes your car move around and you don't even touch it. But if you do this, you will get banned and you will get banned fast and lose all your cars, all your money, everything in the game. So you definitely don't want to do that. And the second thing is, let's say I go ahead, take my phone out right, right here, use this, and I hop on Roblox on another account and decide to, you know, let myself win a few races. I just go in here, oh, let me put my all account in and let's get some free wins. Nope, you can't do that. You will get banned if you do that also. So definitely do not do those two things. But let's go ahead and showcase the first method that won't get you banned if you do it. Okay, so the first legitimate method to make money in this game, this one is my personal favorite. Back when I used to have to grind this game, now I got quite a bit of money. But when I used to have to grind, I would use this one a lot. So basically what you're gonna do is, Get out a car with a very fast top speed. Any car with the, the fastest top speed you have, you want to use that car, right? And then you see this highway I'm driving on, right? Let's just go ahead. You have to drive like back and forth on it, right? So it's a really, really long highway. So let's go ahead and see how far I can go. And we're at the end finally. Okay, brakes, bam. So as you can see, that highway is very long. So if you drive back and forth on this, you can make quite a bit of money. Now I believe it's 25K, so $25,000 per loop, I think. So if you go back and forth, you make $25,000. I got that info from ABC Glitch, shout out to him. He actually made this video. I was literally planning this video for the past month and then he just drops it right before I was about to drop this one. So that's unfortunate, but hey, he made the same video. So it's whatever, all good. Now, something that could help you improve the amount of money you're making is if you go here, right? You go to passes and you purchase VIP, you actually will get 50% more cash. So little tip right there, go ahead, buy that VIP game pass. Now I'm gonna go ahead and let's see, I'm gonna swap into the one of the fastest cars in the game. I don't know if it's the fastest, but I know it's one of the fastest. So I'm gonna use this to get back over there. And then I will show you guys the next method. Whoa, 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 hold up, hold up. I just remembered something. Before I show you the next method, there's actually something that can make this grinding experience more enjoyable for you. So if you want to, you can watch a YouTube video or a TikTok or any type of video, to be honest, just on like the other area of your screen, let's say, you want to minimize Roblox. You know what? I'm going to go ahead and show you real quick what you can do. Watch this. Watch this. Okay, so just like this, as you can see, I got my screen split in half, right? And I want to watch the newest Card of the Car video because he's my favorite <laughs> YouTuber, am I right? So let's say I want to watch one of his videos, right? While we do some driving, I can literally just go ahead. Let's see. I can go over here and I can play my video while I am driving down the highway. So if I split my screen just like this. Now, if you are a mobile player, what you can do is, let's say you're playing on an iPad and you have maybe a phone, you can play the game on one device while watching a video on the other. If you only have one device accessible, then I don't think you can do this. You can only do one thing at a time. So you can probably just only play the game. So that's unfortunate, but hey, you could watch a car to the car video instead of grinding if you want. You can do either or, they're both great options. Okay, now we need to figure out what the best way to make money is. While that method was easy, just driving back and forth on the highway, so that's going to be the easiest method. What is the best method to make the most money possible? Well, here's the thing. There's tons of different races, as you can see right here. Look, we got Sandy Shores Race, Rush Hour Race, Drawbridge Sprint, Circuit Race, Cross Country Race, Drag Race, Highway Race, and Sophia Bay Race. So that's one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, eight different races. Well. We got to start going through these and eliminating which ones don't make you enough money to actually grind it. So let's start off with the drag race. I think that's a good one to eliminate because you're just going in a straight line over and over. While it seems easy, right? The amount of time you spend waiting makes it ineffective because you spend so long waiting when you actually get to do the race. It happens so fast. It just makes that method ineffective. And same thing with the highway, to be honest. Like 
you can only make like eight thousand dollars i believe from one race so it's definitely pretty slow um you do make money from driving in all these races as well obviously that's something we have to take into account but still there's much more efficient ways to make money because some races give out more money than others but like you still spend the same amount of time on them so let's go over what the best one is okay so before you actually go ahead and pick the race you're gonna do i'm gonna show you guys which one you're supposed to do in a minute with this method um you actually should try to get the hennessy venom f5 now i know you're like how do you get that car if you're poor well it's gonna take some grinding from the first method or the method i'm about to show you but i'm using this car since it's currently one of the most op cars in the game so I'm going to try it out for these uh, methods I'm using, and this is going to be the one that we're going to use to demonstrate the time. So, now I've got through that, let's go ahead and showcase the races. Now, I was thinking the best way was going to be the circuit race and the cross country, but I believe I'm wrong, actually. So, apparently, the rush hour race will give you more in one hour than the circuit and cross country. Now, the circuit and cross country give you very similar amounts of money in a very similar amount of time, so... I'm gonna just say, we're, we don't need to worry about that. I'm gonna, I'm gonna try one of those races. We're not gonna try both. We'll do one race, I'll do the circuit race, and then I'll compare it to the rush hour. So I'm gonna go ahead and do the rush hour race right now. I need to get someone to help me with that race. Um, and then after that, I will calculate how much you'll make per hour with this race, and then I'll do the same thing at the circuit. So let's go ahead and cue a time lapse of this race right now. All right, and we finished the race in 47 seconds, and we made $25,000, and we got a $1,250 bonus. Now, I'm not sure what that bonus is. It might be because of my VIP, so I just won't include that in the um, in the final uh, calculation. So I'm going to go ahead and pull out a calculator right now, and we're going to see how much you can make per hour. So let's go ahead and get that started real quick. All right, so we got our calculator here. Now, let's say, so the race took us 47 seconds, and... Every time you want to start the race, it takes about another 10 seconds. So we have to add 47 plus, um, let's say 15 because of the time it takes to get back to the start of the race. So that's going to be 62 seconds per race. Now we need to keep that number in mind, 62. So 60, 60 minutes an hour times another 60 because 60 seconds per minute divided by 62. So that's how many times you can do this race per hour. So we're going to go times... Uh, how many did we say? Uh, $25,000, I think. There we go. So you can make $1,451,612 per hour with this. Wow. That's pretty darn effective. If my calculations are correct, you can make $1,451,612 per hour, right? That's a lot of money per hour in this game. Wow. Okay, now I'm going to do the literal exact same thing at the circuit race, and we're going to see if this is more effective or less effective than the other race. Alright, I told them to let me win for a video. I'm testing something, so hopefully they let me win this race because I am not the best circuit racer, so we have to take that into account. Hopefully, if I do lose, it shows how much money the first place driver gets, but I'm going to go ahead and keep a time lapse right now so I don't crash and screw up. No, 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 bro. I was so close to hitting that checkpoint right there. Dang it. Yo, hold up. Did we just lap that guy? That guy must be really bad at racing or he's just purposely doing all that to let me win because I just lapped him. I'm a whole lap ahead and we are in the same exact car, I think. Wow, I'm, I'm just that good today at racing. Looks like we're going to come in first place. Let's see how much we get. So this took us two minutes and 48 seconds and then we have to take into account that other 15 seconds. So I'll add that on. And then we made $45,000 and then that bonus, which we won't include. So let me go ahead and calculate right now. Okay, so in an hour, there's 3,600 seconds, right? Because 60 minutes times 60 seconds is 3,600. Then we have my race time of 2 minutes and 48 seconds, which is 168 seconds. Then we have to add on 15 because of waiting for it to start. So that'll be divided. We have to divide it by 183, I believe. That's the number. Smart man, big brain. So 
You can do this race 19 times in an hour. Then we got 45,000. So times $45,000. That'd be 885,000. Um, so let's say I did the cross country race, similar time, maybe like 800,000 to a million. Definitely not as efficient as the rush hour race, as you can see. So definitely go ahead and do the rush hour instead of the circuit. I mean, it's quite clear, man. This race literally makes you like $600,000 less than that other one. So I would definitely be doing the other one because this race requires skill. The other one, you just have to drive in like basically around the city. That's way easier than driving around a track. I mean, I don't know, man. It seems a lot more beneficial to do the other. Now, you might have a ton of money in this game already, but you just want to get, you know, maybe the brand new cars every update, and you might not have a ton of money, and you're a noob. Well, if you have a ton of money already, then you probably have a good car and can do what I did, but let's say you don't have the best car. Let's scroll down here. What car might you have? Maybe you have this thing right here. This is a pretty popular one. I see a lot of these around, so you can still do the same methods that I showcased, just it might take a bit longer, and you might make a bit less hourly, so... Best of luck to you all new players. I hope you all can get the cars that you want in this game, and I really hope my method can help you all. Well, I'm gonna wrap up my video here. Make sure to drop a like if this helped you. I would truly appreciate it. Subscribe, ring that notification bell so you never miss another upload, and I will see you all in the next one. Peace.